In 1853, the Illinois legislature allowed the Railroad Bridge Company to build a bridge across the Mississippi River to enhance trade and travel between East and West. After completion in 1856, a steamship crashed into the bridge, creating a legal battle where future President Abraham Lincoln defended the bridge company, arguing the bridge's necessity for railroad development. Although the jury was split, the case set a precedent as Lincoln's argument emphasized the importance of railroads for commerce. In the Supreme Court case, Mississippi and MR Company v. Ward, it was ruled that such bridges across major rivers weren't inherently obstructive. So, while watching recent events in Baltimore, pondering the safety of bridges over navigable rivers, remember, Abraham Lincoln played a role in establishing their legality.